Hi, I'm Laughing Woman, and I'm doing a reading here so that we can look at the week ahead and plan where we want to be in relation to the dominant energies of the week. The first card is Three of Water, Loyalty. The second card is Major 17, Gratitude. The third card is Three of Fire, Growth. The fourth card is Keeper of Water, Wisdom. And the fifth card is Nurturer of Bridges, Collaborate. So we have a nice mix of energies this week between action and, and emotion and spiritual connection. Um, a lot of variety as we move through the week this week. We begin the week with loyalty. This is very simply what it says. Whoever the people are, whatever the situations are that you hold dear, be loyal to them this week. Be true to who they think you are and stand beside them. We move from loyalty into gratitude. This tells me that you've got the right connections over here because you're grateful you have them. Be in that gratitude about everything in life. Whatever the beauty is that comes to you from your existing relationships, spread it across your life, share it with other people, Share it in the way that you interact with the world this week. From gratitude, we move into growth at the middle of the week. Step into something that helps you expand yourself. This isn't necessarily growth of your mind as in learning something new. This is growth. This is being a bigger person in the world. So step in there in a way that you appreciate and that really shows the beauty of who you are. From that growth, we step into wisdom. I love the wisdom card. Wisdom comes from a combination of experience and inspiration and compassion. Exercise your wisdom wherever you are this week. This is never something that's forced on other people. This is something that you hold. It's a way of your being and expressing through the way that you interact with people. Have fun being one of the wisdom keepers and one of the wise ones in some situations this week. Toward the end of the week, we're moving into collaborate. What this says is find a partner to do some things with. This is typically project-oriented in some way. This isn't about a love partner. This is about just finding a friend or a co-worker, somebody that can help you do something that you're doing that they're also doing. You're working together on a project of joint interest. So, in summary for the week, start by being loyal and enjoying the relationships and situations that you feel loyal to. Spread your gratitude out into the world. It's a wonderful thing to share. Grow, grow. Give yourself permission to become a bigger person this week. And share your wisdom. You have wisdom to share. Let it shine in the world. And then find someone to do something with. Work together on a joint project that both of you find fulfilling. Have a really delightful week this week.